When I was 21. What is going on guys? Kooks46 here bringing you a brand new video, MLB 16 Diamond Dynasty head to head. So if you've been keeping up with the Diamond Dynasty episodes lately, you'll know that it's been a pretty rough journey. I lost my last head to head. Honestly, the guy was better than me. So I mean, he beat me, but there was some weird stuff that went down in the game. I lost my last Battle Royale game because of some stupid connection issues that were out of my control. And then I just lost my last Conquest game because, well, I suck balls. So I'm just dying for a win. I really need one. So I'm going to head into a head to head game. Hopefully I get somebody that I can beat because I I am just thirsty for a win, so let's go ahead and get into this game. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. It'll be Diamond Dynasty Season Series play here between the Nuts and the Aces. It's baseball, it's the show, and it comes your way next. Oh, there we go. Come on, get down. Oh, it's off his glove. Stay at first, stay at first, stay at first, stay at first, stay at first. Oh, man. I can't believe we got that. I thought that was going to be in the gap at first, but I'll, I'll take anything I can get. Oh, Seager just crushed that ball. Too bad it's hit to the dead center of the park. Ah. Damn it. The worst place I could have possibly hit that ball. Oh, no, 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 no. Please get to second. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> Swung a little too early on that. Hey, Hamilton just drew a walk. Four straight pitches. Now it's up to Hanley to get this run in. And it's going to be a ground out. God, dude, I have got to take advantage of these opportunities, man. That's going to come back to bite me. I know it. Oh, there we go. Got a ground ball. Oh, bare hand by Kyle Seeger. What a play to get that first out. Oh. God, I can't let them get on base like that in early in the game. Got to get out of this inning. There it is. Perfect. Perfect execution of the two seam. Make the throw. Why did you take so long to throw? Hey, there we go. Fly ball directly to Aoki. Catch is made. So we got out of it. Your opponent has requested a concede. If you accept, this game will be over and you will get the win. I'm gonna I'm gonna accept it. I gotta win! I gotta win! Hey, I'm happy about that. You know what I'm happy? I'm counting that as a rage quit. Whoa, my rating actually went up. I didn't even score he got he got a hit. I didn't even get a hit yet. I guess if he just wants to give me a win like that. I'm not going to complain. Okay, so since I just got the win and we're only nine minutes into the recording, uh, I am going to just like go around on my team, see if there's any adjustments I can make, because if I just ended the video there, it'd be way too short. So, I mean, I have Hector Santiago. I could definitely throw him in the rotation. Uh, who's my weakest guy right now? Uh, Derek Holland? Yeah, I'll replace him with uh, Hector Santiago. It's a lefty. For the same, you know, I'll take it. So there's not really a lot of moves that make sense for me on uh, this of the uh, the bullpen because I need to keep a few lefties in there. Only, yeah, I kind of need to keep it the way it is right now. Yeah, I'm going to keep it. Okay, actually, I just put in Hector Rondon into my uh, middle reliever spot. It just gives me some relievers with better overall. Maybe get my team a little bit better, even though these guys are all closers. I'm going to put Pedro Strope out and put in Sean... Actually, no, I'll leave Strop in. He's good, actually. He's, he's performed well for me. And then I got my two lefties that I have leaving in there. Catcher's pretty much going to be the same. Salvador Perez and Giovanni Soto. Now, here's where first base gets a little bit tricky because I already have four first basemen in my squad and I just got Ryan Zimmerman. So actually, what I'm going to do is I want to keep Justin Bohr in the lineup for me because he performs really well and he's the best overall that I have right now with the adjusted uh, numbers. So I'm going to put Ryan Zimmerman in Mitch Moreland's spot off the bench because I think that's a good call. I don't really need two lefties off the bench like that. Brandon Belt could be my power hitting lefty off the bench. I think that's fine. So second base, I'm going to keep Ian Kinsler where he is, uh, the bench. I don't really have any infielders for the bench. I mean, I got Howie Kendrick, 
who I know has played second base, obviously, because I'm an Angels fan. I watched him play second base for years, but his position is listed at left field, but he, he can go into to second base. That's fine. I'll, I'll keep this, this the way it is. Third base, got Kyle Seager there. I don't think there's anything to edit here. He's, he's solid over there. Okay, so for shortstop, this is where I'm a little confused. What should I do? I have Trevor Story, who I just got from a card pack, who's got an 83 overall, like adjusted overall right now, but I, I really like his Drupal Cabrera because he's a switch hitter. He uh, switches up the lineup at the bottom end. So, I mean, like, I kind of want to keep him, but I also kind of want to put in Trevor Story just because he's hot right now. All right, you know what? I'm going to make the call. I'm going to put Trevor Story in above as Drupal Cabrera. I think that's a better move for right now. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace Howie Kendrick with his Drupal Cabrera. So the Cabrera is still going to be on my squad. And he's an actual infielder that I could throw in there if I need to. Left field should be good with Josh Hamilton. Center field should be good with... Uh, actually, left field is Hanley Ramirez. Center field, Josh Hamilton. That looks good. And then right field, I got uh, Nori Aoki. A A Aoki really hasn't performed very well for me. So I think I'm going to throw in Gregory Polanco into right field. I think that'll work better for me, actually. All right, guys, so there you have it. That's a little bit of a new look at the squad. Uh, just changed a few players around, got some new additions. Hopefully, they help the team out. Maybe we can win more games now. So, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, you know what to do. Hit the like button. Uh, make sure you subscribe so you never miss a moment of Diamond Dynasty action. And that is all I have for you today. So, until the next video, I will see you later.